long day as we are right here. Our Rahel Solomon live at the Denver Elections Division this morning. So, Rahel, I've been following these numbers. There has been heavy Republican turnout, but that's not unusual, right? Right. Officials say that registered Democrats tend to vote a little later, so that's not unusual, as you mentioned. And, Alan, right now we're at an election center, a polling center right now. Uh, elections start to uh, underway in a couple of minutes. But joining us now is Alton Dillard. He's the spokesman for the Denver Elections Division. Alton, thank you for being with us this morning. Certainly. Good morning. Tell us what you're expecting this morning as far as turnout here. All right. Well, you never can quite guess turnout because, again, the, the mail ballots are in the hands of the voters. But we're expecting a pretty busy day here at Denver Elections. And you were saying earlier that Denver voters tend to be day of, and so certainly a lot of people expect it today. Correct. We have 25 voter po polling and service centers, and then we also have 23 24-hour drop boxes available for the voters in the city and county of Denver. We're expecting to see a lot of traffic at those as the day goes on. And for those folks watching, at home who are wondering where their center is, what website or where can they go to find that information? They can find that information in a couple of places. They can find it at our Denver Votes app or at denvervotes.org. If you're in the city and county of Denver, if you're watching from outside the city and county of Denver, you can also go to mycoloradovote.com. And Alton, last election, you told me you guys were here well past midnight. What are you expecting this time around? We're expecting the same. We have some officials built into our ballot process now that will help, but because of the fact we're expecting a pretty heavy late day uh, turnout today, we're probably going to be here well into uh, Wednesday morning. Okay. Alton, thank you very much for being with us this morning. Thank you. And of course, voting starts at 7 a.m., and we will be here throughout the morning. We'll have another update for you at 5.30. But for now, reporting live, Rahel Solomon, CBS 4 Morning.